Ismail Haniyeh, the prominent leader of Hamas, was assassinated in Tehran, according to a statement by Iran's paramilitary revolutionary guard early Wednesday. The assassination occurred while Haniyeh was in the Iranian capital to attend the swearing-in ceremony of Iran's president, Masoud Pazeshkian, on Tuesday. The details of the assassination remain sparse, with the Revolutionary Guard stating that the incident is under investigation. Initial suspicions have fallen on Israel, which has previously vowed to target Haniyeh and other Hamas leaders following the group's October 7 attack on Israel. That assault resulted in the deaths of 1,200 people and the taking of approximately 250 hostages. In a statement, Hamas confirmed the death of Haniyeh, attributing it to a treacherous Zionist raid on his residence in Tehran. Iranian state media echoed this sentiment, quoting the Revolutionary Guard and analysts who blamed Israel for the attack. Reports indicate that Haniyeh and one of his bodyguards were killed when the building they were staying in was struck. The assassination marks a significant escalation in the already tense relations between Israel and Hamas, and it is expected to have far-reaching implications for the region. Hamas, in mourning, has hailed Haniyeh as a martyr, intensifying the rhetoric against Israel. The international community is closely monitoring the situation as investigations continue into the details and perpetrators of the assassination.